Hey everybody, this is Mount To Do Soldier playing Eternal Darkness, and it is Requiem. Uh, we're currently playing as Kareem, and I want to finish this uh, chapter up right about now. Tucked into a niche with the Lost Known Tablets found, Magical Codex. So now we got the um, Codex, what that means. Is, um, where's that icon? Yeah, this way. Item? Is this one? Absorb. Yeah, the Recover spell is Absorb. Self. Pretty sure that's what it is. Maybe it. Maybe I'm wrong. No, no, no. Check. Uh, Narcoth and Sentek. Narcoth and Sentek. Let's absorb. Self. Self. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, that's what we have right now. Alright, this, uh, this is going to be a part right here. I'm going to do a quick save. Just in case. Because. Uh, I may have a small hard time with those little creatures that can <laughs> that can burst out of the body. All right, yeah, we're in this room where PS uh, uh, put the four cubes in uh, on those icons. All right, we get a sword here. Rumdo broad sword protrude. What? Yeah. Next time, should Kareem try to pull the sword from the stone? Yes! We'll actually be uh, needing to use that sword uh, for a door. And okay. Uh, we're going to have quite a battle in here. There are going to be a few waves of the. Oh crap! Yeah. Uh, don't worry about trying to finish them off because we're pointless. Oh, fun fact, um, in the original plans for this chapter, um, Kareem wasn't supposed to be the character for the chapter, but after 9-11 happened, they, uh, had him as a character for this one. I don't really know the specific reasons why they did it, but they decided to do it after 9-11. Uh, Oh crap! Oh yeah! I, oh my god! Holy crap! Yeah, I, I'm really loosening. I can't really recover anything. I can't recover my sanity. I should really start using a sword, huh? Yeah. I want to start using a sword. I can't really. Oh my gosh! I can't <laughs> keep having my health drain. Right now, I'm gonna quickly enchant that, uh. Rumpole. Oh! Oh! What the heck? Jeez, that interrupted my, uh, my spell. I have a bad feeling one of these have one of those, um, blue creatures. <laughs> I don't know the name of these creatures. I'm just described it based on the color. Alright, let's start enchanting that. Officially. Sorry, just that I'm once I'm constantly uh, getting my headset off my uh, off my head. Because I don't like the I don't like to get scared like that with my headphones on. Hallucinating like that. Uh, it's a little scary. So, holy crap! What the heck? Come on! Come on, man! better not. You better not get into my body and kill me. Alright. Woohoo! Magical room, get out. And son of a gun. I am not loving this. Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, poor weapon choice here. Okay. Constantly move around. That's how I can tell. Because if, if one of these uh, things jump on you, and get into your body. Yeah, you're dead. Because they're going to burst out of your body. Okay, oh my gosh. Oh, man. I'm glad that part's over. Wait. So, I got the blue icon. Wait, what's this I got? Um, G. 
chance. Oh, uh, yeah, that's what I got. Yeah, I got the blue one, which means I can recover magic, but I have tons of magic. Sanity? Nah, health? Actually, I'm gonna start recovering some health here. Actually, I'm gonna assign um, the health spell. Okay, I got the enchant iron for the Y. I'm always used to assign that to the Y button. We'll make it uh, top right there. There we go. Up D pad. Okay. Alright. So. Actually, I want to do a quick save here. I'm just happy I got this part over with. Let's see, about. Well, about six minutes into this video, I can definitely finish this chapter up. Okay, now we are going to start a chanting. Uh, this um, sword chant with the corresponding uh, symbol that's on the door. For sure, it's the one way to use it. Yep. Okay, uh, there is an optional uh, room. We are going to go for it. You go up this ladder. Now, there are some trappers here. We'll use the chuck rams to kill them. And please don't teleport me. Oh man, I'm getting anxious just hearing them. Okay, that's it. Alright. Now let's grab this. Uh, this is... Ruby Effigy. And did I just hear a three-headed creature? Or am I just hallucinating? Along the length of the corridor, the ceiling has given away and collapsed. Littering the floor with debris. Should Kareem climb over the rubble? Yes, let's climb over. Now... <sighs> Yeah. Actually, actually, this one I can actually kill because he is. Wow. Okay, never mind. It was a red one again, and he didn't drain my health. So uh, I guess that once this sword here, just one hits from it, can kill uh kill that big monster. So it's going to be pretty uh handy uh. Right here, we're getting close to the end of the chapter. All right, now for the first and actually only time in the game, you actually get to use the tome here. Yeah, I mean, for human skin, yeah. Okay, so I am going to actually, yeah, we'll pick that back up. I'm going to save right here. Yeah, let's save right there. Alright. Now, I'm going to actually enchant the... This again. Wait. Red, blue. Actually, I think one... Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll chant that with the blue again. I guess, I guess the, the color that I enchant the weapon with will just make them much more powerful against the one, uh, other color, like that red creature. So, yeah, we'll use blue. Alright, get ready for, uh, 
Oh, another wave of enemies. Starts with these uh, skeletons here. And I should really use a recovery spell. Man, Akrain's tough if he can take it. Oh, crap. be a third wave of these. And... Yep! Woohoo! Okay, I should really, uh, enchant the sword one more time. Because I have a feeling the... Holy crap. Okay, might as well use a quick recover spell. Oh crap! Different color! Well, at least he's not going to complete my, uh, health. Yeah, he's going to come through. Alright, just be careful. Sometimes he has. Yep, like that. Woohoo! Yeah, one hit! He's down. We can finish this chapter up now. all the runes we have so far. And we got a recover spell, enchant spell. Okay, let's finish this chapter up. A strange sculpture resembling a red clawed worm mysteriously floats above the pedestal. Should Kareem claim the artifact? Yes. Kareem. We will be together forever. Chandra? What... What happened to you? Things change, my dear Kareem. But even though my body is ravaged, I await you. Who did this to you? You were gone so long. I... I gave myself to a nobleman with a jealous mistress. She had me dragged from my bed, and in cruel revenge, flensed with knives. As the last blades were drawn across my body, and my blood cooled upon the floor, she cursed that I would only be with another in death. So much for thinking only of me. I should never have left. I have seen my folly, and have already paid dearly. I see so much more now, in death. I know the true value of the artifact which I asked you to find, and it is not for us to possess. If we are to be together again, you must make a sacrifice. Only when that is complete will we be together. Sacrifice? Why should I do anything for you? You lied to me, betrayed me, and you really don't look so good anymore. You must forget the past. Despite who you are now, you will also become something more, just as I have. But the sacrifice must be made. 
We must remain here and guard the artifact. Dark things will come to claim it, and you must be strong to keep it from them. Without your sacrifice, the world will fall into eternal darkness. The things I do for love. Yeah, chapter complete. Yeah, Kareem has sacrificed himself. And yep, to be continued. The battle has been won, but the war against the darkness is far from over. Yep, San Diego's redemption. This can't be happening. It's a mandatory hallucination. <laughs> Okay, so uh, that's it for this chapter. So in the next video, we are going to go a little further. Yeah, that'll be it for this one. This is Mount to Do Soldier signing off, and I'll see you next time.